the Indian Institute of Technology, Delhi, is one of the oldest IITs to be established in India. Actually, IIT was initially established as the College of Engineering in the year 1961. Later on, this College of Engineering was given the status of Institute of National Importance under the IIT Act of 1963. And that is when this College of Engineering became our very own IIT D or IIT Delhi. In the year 2018, IIT Delhi was also awarded with the status of Institute of Eminence. In fact, IIT Delhi was one of the first three institute to be given this status in the year 2018. Even now, we only have 16 Institute of Eminence in India and IITD is one of them. This Institute of Eminence has a total of 3,400 students studying in various undergraduate, postgraduate and research programs. This Institute of Eminence, this Institute of National Importance is also well known for its research of PhD program. And today, I, Dr. Ritika Gaba, your one and only PhD mentor, advisor and trainer, is going to tell you all about the PhD program of IIT Delhi. So let us start with the most important and the most obvious question. In what subjects does IIT Delhi offer a PhD? So IIT Delhi being an engineering institute obviously would offer a PhD in engineering. Along with it, it also offers you PhD in subjects like science, humanities, management, social sciences. Besides this, there are other subjects related to artificial intelligence, biomedical, architecture, design, telecommunications and so on. Each of these broad categories have various subcategories and research areas within it. And if this is not enough, then IIT Delhi also runs a school of interdisciplinary studies. I can assure you that almost all subjects which are relevant in today's time are offered as a research program by this eminent institute. So now that you know that in which subjects IIT Delhi lets you pursue your PhD, I am sure that the next question is, what qualifications are required to pursue your PhD or what are the eligibility criteria to pursue your PhD from this prestigious institute? So IIT Delhi would let you pursue your PhD if you are a postgraduate with 60% marks or a four-year graduate with 70% marks. Besides this, even if you are currently pursuing or are in the final year of your qualifying degree, either a post-graduation or your four-year graduation, in both these cases also you can apply to the PhD program of IITD. Of course, you would have to ensure that your all your viva and your exams, everything is finished before the start of your PhD program. Yes, a 5% relaxation is given to certain categories of students. From here, we move on to the next important question. That does IIT Delhi allow working professionals to pursue a PhD? Or in other words, does IIT Delhi also offer a part-time PhD or is it offering only a full-time PhD? So IIT Delhi offers both full-time and part-time PhD. If you want to pursue a part-time PhD, that is, if you want to pursue a PhD while you continue working, then in that case, for such candidate, IIT Delhi requires, besides the qualification that I had just mentioned, they want you to have certain years of experience as well. For the students who want to pursue a full-time PhD, good news for you is that IIT Delhi gives a monthly stipend to majority of their full-time students along with many other perks. Working professionals who want to apply for the part-time PhD program of IITD will have to compulsorily submit a no objection certificate or an NOC issued by their organization. In case these terminologies of part-time PhD and full-time PhD 
are new to you you do not understand what these terms are or if you have questions like will i have to stay in the campus if i'm pursuing a full time phd is part time phd as recognized as full time phd then this is probably because you've not watched our previous videos dedicated to both these terms sharing with you links of some of our popular videos do have a look for a complete understanding of what part time phd is and what a full time phd is from here we move on to the next question which i'm sure you are very eager to ask do you require to qualify the gate examination if you want to apply to the phd program of iit the answer is no gate is not a compulsory qualification to apply to the phd program of iit definitely many students assume that because gate is an examination which is conducted by iits it is probably important or compulsory to qualify this exam but iits accept multiple national level examination and not only gate so yes it accepts gate but along with it it accepts multiple other national level examination so definitely check with your department that you are eager to apply that what examinations are being accepted and you can opt for any one of the eligibility examination in fact most of the working professionals are selected only based on their application their sop or research proposal and the years of experience they are not even required to give any kind of eligibility examination not only part time professionals but even certain students who are applying for a full time program even they are exempted from any kind of eligibility examination so these are usually those students who have uh, done their post graduation or their four year graduation from certain extremely reputed uh, educational institutions or have scored extremely well in their qualifying degrees so definitely check even whether you do require an eligibility examination or not so with this i'm sure the last and the most important question which is coming to your mind is when and how to apply to the phd program of iit delhi so iit delhi opens its application which can be so you can apply to the phd program only online and these online application opens twice a year once in october for the january session and once in march for the july session and yes for the july 2023 session the applications are already open the last date to apply is 30th of march 2023 with this we come to the end of our video if in case you want any more details about iit delhi or any other iits if you are looking for a phd mentor who can guide you through your phd admission journey somebody who can guide you about how to write a professional sop or how to write a technical research proposal if you are looking for somebody with whom you can discuss your research ideas your research topics if you want somebody who can tell you how to start prepare for your phd journey what are the options of phd that you have what would be suitable for you in short if you are looking for a phd mentor advisor and trainer then you can get in touch with me on the number given below for a personalized one to one session thank you so much for watching this video and don't forget to like share and subscribe this video and our channel thank you so much